Good morning children. You are learning computer. Let us revise. From your class work copy. Let us start. Chapter 2, question number 1. Write 5 ways of using computer. Children, when I will read, you will repeat with me. Then you will learn. Question number one, write five ways of using computer. We can use a computer too. We can use a computer to dash letters, dash pictures, dash sums, dash to music, dash movies. We can use a computer to type letters. Check the spellings T Y P E type. T Y P E type. Type letters. Draw pictures. D R A W. Draw pictures. Solve sums. S O L V E. Solve sums. Listen, L-I-S-T-E-N, listen to music. Watch movies, W-A-T-C-H, watch movies. So, we can use a computer to type letters, draw pictures, solve sums, listen to music, watch movies. Question number two, name any eight places where computers are used. Name any eight places where computers are used. Computers are used in school, home, bank, shops, office, hospital, school, Home, bank, shops, office, hospital, airport, railway station, airport, railway station. Then let us do the rearrange the letters. S C O L H C. School, S C H O L school, O S H P T A L I hospital, H O S P I T A L hospital, A N K B B A N K bank. This is the answer. B A N K bank, A A Y R I L W S T A T I O N station. This answer is railway station. R A I L rail W A Y V railway S T A T I O N station railway station. F F I E C O answer is office O F F I C E office. Now, question number three: How computers are used in school? What is the answer? To learn new things. To learn new things. Question number four. How computers are used in bank? To keep records. To keep records. Question number five. How computers are used in shops? To pay bills. To pay bills. Question number six. How computers are used at railway station? To book tickets. To book tickets. Now, in the, the question answers we did that may come in the fill in the blanks way also that you did in your class for copy. The answers you know now. 
Now, chapter 3, name four main parts of a computer. The four main parts of a computer are, there are four main parts of a computer. Always remember children, four main parts of a computer. Monitor, mouse, keyboard, system cabinet and CPU. Monitor, mouse, keyboard, system cabinet and CPU. This one you can write CPU also. The so four in your book it is given system cabinet and CPU. The whole thing you learn. And see the four main parts of a computer are monitor m o n i t o r monitor m o u s e mouse k e y b o a r d keyboard system s y s t e m system c a b i n e t cabinet and c p u when you will write c p u and u p s always write in capital the four main parts of a computer you know now Next one, name four helping parts of a computer. Helping parts of a computer are printer, UPS, scanner, speakers. Children, either you write in capital letter or you write in small letters. That doesn't matter. The answer should be correct. And the spellings should be correct. Helping parts of a computer are Printer, P-R-I-N-T-E-R, printer, U-P-S, scanner, S-C-A-N-N-E-R, scanner, speaker, S-P-E-A-K-E-R-S, -E -E speakers. Then fill the missing letters. There are other helping parts also. If you want to write, you can write them also, but the answer should be correct and the spellings also should be correct. Fill the missing letters. CPU. Central Processing Unit. It may come in this way. Fill the missing letters. So you will have to fill. C E dash T R A dash. Central. C E N T R A L. Central. P R O C E dash dash I N G. P R O C E S S I N G. Processing Unit. So what is the full form of CPU? Central Processing Unit. Central Processing Unit. Next one, UPS. What is the full form of UPS? Uninterruptible Power Supply. Uninterruptible Power Supply. P-O-W dash dash. P-O-W-E-R. Power. S-U dash dash L-Y. S-U double P L-Y. So, uh, uninterrupted power supply is the full form of UPS. Fill in the blanks. A monitor looks like a television. Children you can write here TV also. Television or TV. Same. Means correct answer. A monitor looks like a television. A keyboard is used to dash letters. A keyboard is used to type letters. A keyboard has many dash. A keyboard has many keys. System cabinet holds the dash and other parts of a computer. System cabinet holds the CPU and other parts of a computer. A computer mouse is used to dash things and dash pictures on the monitor. A computer mouse is used to point things and draw pictures on the monitor. CPU is called the dash of the computer. CPU is called the brain of the computer. Now fill in the blanks. A printer is used to dash our work. A printer is used to print our work. A scanner is used to dash paper, copy paper documents in computer. Speakers helps to hear dash. Speakers help to hear sound. Speakers help to hear sound. UPS supplies dash to the computer. UPS supplies power to the computer for dash for some time when electricity goes off what is booting starting a computer what is desktop the screen of on the monitor what are icons the small pictures on the 
desktop this all you did last day so in the previous video so you know the answers fill in the blanks we should keep the computer covered we should not touch a computer with dash hands we should not touch a computer with wet hands the mouse should be kept on the mouse pad we should not dash or dash on a computer table we should not eat or drink on a computer table so this is your revision for today learn the class works with the spellings bye bye